around 23 miles per hour. It'll move over northern Florida within the next 12 hours or so, then across basically the southern portion of the Carolinas, including eastern uh, South Carolina, southern North Carolina, and then out to sea as we get closer to the end of the weekend. But still, it means a huge amount of rain for parts of the deep south, and that's why we'll watch it very closely for you. Watching closely our weather as well. Let's skip ahead over to marathon weather. Sunday morning looking great for the runners. It'll be comfortable. Sure, maybe chilly for the uh, spectators, but for runners, nearly perfect. Upper 40s and low 50s for the start of the race, closer to 60 degrees by midday, and temperatures climb from there. We'll get to your Sunday afternoon in just a moment. 40 degrees right now for our friends over in the Romeo area, also around Utica. Already upper 30s in places like uh, Monroe and also in Dundee. Morning lows this uh, the earlier this morning were at the freezing mark. I know many of us woke up with quite a bit of frost out there, but the chances are less likely for tomorrow morning. 59 was the high in Chicago, 61 in Indianapolis, while we had a high temperature of 56. Well, we have high pressure overhead. Winds around it are clockwise, and we'll get that southern or southwesterly flow eventually. That means higher temperatures for tomorrow, like it'll be around 60 degrees or just a bit more, and then even warmer into Sunday. In between, we've got this trough of low pressure, very weak. It could mean a spot of, of a sprinkler or two tomorrow night, but that is it. Better chance of rain comes after the weekend. So overnight tonight, 40 degrees for the most part right here in the city, but more likely middle and upper 30s elsewhere. Sunrise on your Saturday is at 750. Great weather for tomorrow. Uh, we are looking at temperatures that will be in the low 60s with partly to mostly sunny skies all day long. Terrific marathon weather once again on Sunday morning, Sunday afternoon, even warmer, almost spring like. I'm going to call it spring like why not upper 60s same thing on Monday with a shower better chance of rain on both Monday and Tuesday then we ease back into the 50s. Yeah.